What a tangled web we weave when first we practice to deceive. Joe Biden would have been very, very, very well served to hear that message, to learn that lesson as a child. But alas, we believe it's something he did not learn because he has deceived and now he's been caught. We're going to get right to that story as the FBI is all over Joe Biden. But first, before we get started, folks, I want to ask you to please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please follow us at Explain America. And while you're at it, go to a little search bar on top of your page and type in Explain America Lounge on Facebook, and you'll find our little group. Come in there, join us. We share our videos in there. We share stories in there. We share some funny memes in there. You'll have a good time if you are a patriot. Now, Joe Biden has really handled this classified documents situation from a political standpoint horribly. If you had to draw a blueprint about how to horribly handle this situation, he's following that blueprint pretty closely. See, folks, what he didn't tell you as the drip, 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 drip continues from this classified document story is that he had the FBI descend on his Penn Biden Center in November to do a search for classified documents. Now, this was after Biden's legal team advised the National Archives that there were classified documents that were found. The FBI descended with permission from the Biden legal team and did a search of the Penn Biden Center, but this information has been hidden. That was November, December, end of January. It's almost February. We're just hearing about it now, and we're not hearing about it from the White House. We heard about it from a breaking story from, of all places, CNN. Now, it makes you wonder, what's going on with the mainstream media? What's going on with the mainstream media? This sudden turn on Joe Biden before he announces his presidential campaign officially for 2024. What could be afoot, as they say? What's going on there? I don't know. Do they want him removed? Do they want to see Kamala Harris as the president, president laughing face of the United States? I don't know. But I do know that the White House has not been honest with us. They keep saying, that's it. There's no more. That's all the information there is. You're not going to hear anything else. Boom, here's something else. Oh, you're not going to hear anything else now. Boom, here's something else. And to, to hide from people, as you sit on the podium, Corrine Jean-Pierre, White House Press Secretary, to sit at the podium and tell people day after day that, that nothing else happened, and then we keep finding out that other stuff happened, that is not being honest. That's not being transparent with the American people as you claim you are being. Now, it's also worth noting that during this search, the FBI did, in fact, find more classified documents and classified materials. We don't really have a count of how much classified material there is. We don't know what these classified materials are. Are they matters of national security? Are they mundane? We don't know, but we need to get to the bottom of it. And I will tell you this, folks, the Republican Congress is all over it, and they are fighting the Justice Department to get as much information as they can. We here at Explain America, we're going to tell you what the mainstream media is not going to tell you, and we're going to do it every day. So please keep following us on Explain America on Facebook. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Please leave us a comment. Do you think the Democrats want Joe Biden, the Democrats in the media want Joe Biden gone from the 2024 picture so they can insert Kamala Harris? Let us know what you think is going on. We love you guys. God bless you. Take care, everybody.